What's up, y'all? So the Ace Family loses auction. Shocking. I don't know what's going on, to be honest with you. I heard they in debt. And I, it's hard for me to believe because y'all making all that damn money and you're not paying your rent. It, it just it's not adding up to me. The math ain't mathing. Okay. Um, but we're gonna see what happened. Uh, this guy is gonna let us know and grab your snacks and shit. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you leak. So, I already read the title, y'all. Make sure y'all grab your snacks, grab your juice, grab your wine. I'm sipping on wine today. Y'all, make sure y'all follow my Twitch. It's up there in the top corner on this video, Royalties World CEO. Y'all, make sure y'all follow my Twitch. We are currently live streaming over here right now. And it is five o'clock. We've been live streaming since about two. So let's get into it. Out the house. But as many of you know, the Ace Family House was up for auction. Uh, but before the auction, it was up for pre foreclosure. Uh, they allegedly were in debt. They didn't pay their house. They were like in debt for like $9.3 million, which is a lot of money, guys. And well, Karma, I believe she came back and said, you know what? You guys are making your payments. Something bad is going to happen. And that's what happened today, guys. Today, we actually got an update of what's going to happen to the Ace Family House. So the auction took place I want to say um, end of September early October and it did get postponed once or twice but today guys the third time or whatever it is someone actually got the house and before we get further with this video I do want to give a huge shout out to here for the tea on Instagram for actually putting these statements on their page and this is what actually happened there basically the house went back to the beneficiary which means the bank actually took it back what This whole time, I've been like, man, nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> that ain't happening. That's not happening. No, ain't no way. No, because, y'all, I get it. People have, okay, you have bills, employ no, you have employees for real, bills, your family and shit, and then your lifestyle is supposed to come last. These people have been doing lifestyle, employees, bills. No, <laughs> lifestyle, employees, family, then bills. Last. Uh-uh, bro. I do not. Yo, not being able to pay my damn bills and I got all this damn money. It, it just it's not adding up with me. The math is not mathing, and I can't believe they did this. I have been defending this for a very long time because I'm like, nah, ain't no way. Ain't no way you're not going to tell me they doing that. Not they done lost this house, not paying the rent. How you get so backed up to $9 million? That's probably in his bank account. $9 million. Hell no, he ain't about to pay that shit. But how much was the rent? You know what I'm saying? Like, good God, that's crazy. As you guys see there, the highest bid was $9 million, which is a whole lot. I don't know why the bank didn't just want to sell it to someone else. Or maybe this bid was from the bank. This auction took place today, October 19 at 1030 in the morning in Pomona, California. As we all know, Static John has been going to these auctions every single time. And the first two times they were postponed, but this time he got good content. Oh, we're running late. Wait, and this is why if I can't afford to pay cash and own it right out, I don't get it or do a period. Nah, facts. Yeah, you right. He is buying all these cars too. You know the beneficiary, the lender. Oh, went back to the beneficiary. Yeah, 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 yeah. So she came and read it out. No one wanted or something. Is that what I meant? So it's much money. So what? You were following that property, right? Yeah. So how much do you have to have to actually bid on it? It's like ten percent or something? No, 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 no. You have to have a whole of cash. But today you have to have it. Damn. And then, so no one had that today? No, uh, we, they were not interested. They were not interested. Yeah. Now you can buy it back from the beneficiary. You can call the beneficiary and say, hey, you know what? I want to buy it. And, uh, it's a discount. Yeah, discount. So does the beneficiary owns it now officially? But not the homeowner. Damn. So that's over. Damn. Okay. Well, 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 well. They got me yet again. Call the wrong house. What does the street name again? Call the wrong? Yeah, it went it went to sale for nine million and reverted back to me. So no one bought it today? No, nine million? That's not normal for people to buy. That's not normal for these guys though. 
So what happened there? The trustee owns it now? Not the trustee, the, um, the lender. Is that pretty common? If nobody buys it, that's, that's, why, that's why the lender does, you know, the people are not paying. The lender is... Well, yeah, I don't, I'm, I, I'm, I, I don't understand. <clears throat> They're not speaking about like an eviction. You know what I'm saying? And maybe it's different when you're paying all that money. Why aren't we speaking about that? Well, they did say the house is in floor, foreclosure. I forgot about that. So clearly he owned the house. Because ain't that the only way your house is in foreclosure? I am confused. So they can't get paid. Huh? Well, she bought it foreclosed, right? They could have bought it foreclosed, and then if the bank wants it back because you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing, then they will take it back and it goes back under foreclosure. Wow. Nah, that's crazy. Thank you. Yeah. So now it's done. Yeah. So what, what happened now? Appreciate the sub, Nene. That's kind of how that works. Uh, lender, lender, yeah, lender's, lender's if there's problem people now. living in the property, yes, then they, they, will, they will start the procedure to evict. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. No problem. For those people that are still kind of not believing this whole uh, thing I is don't real, even believe it. well, as you see in the document, it also states. <clears throat> Austin's, you know, LLC, the uh, Ace Hat Collection. I believe that's his because we all know that the, you know, the YouTuber versus TikTok event was actually placed through that LLC. Oh. But going back to the Ace Hat, guys, I do feel kind so, of so y'all with the um TikTokers versus whatever. I didn't think that Austin them was supposed to pay them. I thought they was working with another company who basically wasn't counting all them tickets correctly. I thought that's what happened because. How what Austin was just gonna pay himself? Oh man, this yo, this is crazy. Bad that they're actually getting kicked out of their home. At the same time, I don't feel that bad because you know karma is real and karma does come through. And just to lose it like that because you're not making the payments. And we also went through this whole thing. Catherine said on her Snapchat saying, "Oh, I don't. I feel bad that people think I don't pay my bills. Like literally, I pay my bills or whatever." She said because we all know Catherine does tend to beat around the bush. But this time she like you know says she, allegedly she pays her bills. But I don't know. Like this whole house thing. Is telling us otherwise and not to mention they still have those good cars the Lambo the range you know the, all those cars they have at their home and they could have sold all them cars and got that nine million dollars you would think they would try to sell some of the cars to actually keep their house but at the same time guys I don't want to speculate more than I know because what if the bank did buy the house What if the bank just didn't want them in the house anymore? Damn, the company that Austin was working with, they saw him too? Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. Right? And let's say, you know, the bank works something out with the Ace family saying, you know what, if you pay your bills, if you start paying your bills, your monthly mortgage, then, you know, we'll let you keep the house. But I don't know 100% guys, because other people are saying they're getting evicted. And then I know people are worried about their children, about their kids, their babies. But at the same time, guys, they're still not broke. If they needed to get some, if they needed somewhere to stay, to lay their head, they're going to be able to lay their head, y'all. Even they ain't broke you know what i'm saying they may not want to pay that nine million but they ain't broke yes it does suck that their babies have to move somewhere else but they're the kids they're not prob they're not really going to remember of what happened maybe the oldest is like oh my god i missed the house or whatever but kids don't really need that much space to have a good time to play with their siblings you know it doesn't matter if they're in a two-bedroom apartment or that mansion they're still gonna have a good time regardless i do get it it sucks and it's totally not their fault it's their parents fault what their parents did their actions led them to all this to losing their house and now not only the ace family has to look for a new home but also mr landon mcbrew because we all know landon was actually living with austin and now maybe they're gonna pitch in for a bigger house or a nice house because we all know they started in a you know two or three bedroom apartment mm -hmm. austin showed us like where he was and then where he is now this whole mansion in his you know fake ass course he got like how to be a millionaire or whatever this is where it all started right here in this apartment i was living here about five years ago with Catherine. this is where we had l 
And at the time, I was going through depression because my basketball dreams came to an end. But God opened up another door. And so we fast forward. So what would happen now? The lender has to kick them out, and then that's kind of how that works? Uh, lender, that's the lender's, yeah, lender's if there's problem people now. living in the property, yes, they, 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 would, they would start the procedure to... Okay. Yeah. Good luck. Damn. No but guys, let me know what you think about this situation. Wow. Uh, do you guys still think this is fake? And I know some of you Ace family members or are gonna be like so naive. If you guys think this is fake, hey, that's on you guys, but we know the real deal. This is their house. Just let me know down below, guys. And if you're new here, make sure to subscribe, like the video, comment down below, do all that good stuff, guys. I know this video was kind of short. I just want to update you guys of what happened today, October 19, 2021, with this whole Ace family house. They couldn't stay in the apartment because people was pulling up to the apartment. They couldn't even stay in the apartment. <laughs> They had to, they had to move. So, man, ah, oh, man, I, 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 I ain't gonna lie, I, I, I did not expect this. Excuse me, I didn't. I thought it was the capery for me. I thought um, people was lying. And this is a lot. But okay, um, I'm done with this video, man. Uh, y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. We on to the next video. Peace.